Hey everyone, this is Jenny from Homestead Corner, and today I am making some delicious, yummy caramel sauce. Um, we love to dip fruits and things in caramel, uh, especially apple slices are one of our favorites, bananas, whatever we have for fresh fruit. Uh, we love to dip it in here. This is a special treat. I don't do this very often. Um, because my kids would just eat it constantly all the time. It is so delicious and yummy and simple to do. All you need are is a can of sweetened condensed milk and I've just got the um, Great Value brand. This works great. You can use any kind and I'm just going to pop the labels off these. And because they make a mess, the labels can make a mess in your pot and I hate peeling paper out of there when it gets stuck on the side. So we're just going to pop these labels off and you could do one can at a time or two. This can also be done on the stove top but I find this to be the easiest. I can set it in the crock pot and it's magic. In eight hours we've got deliciousness. So I'm just going to take these two cans of sweetened condensed milk and I'm going to put them right inside my crock pot. If you have a white um, pot, uh, I have heard that this stain, this uh, it can make like a rust ring on the bottom, so you could put it on like a little dish or something, but I have never had a problem. Ours is black, so I guess maybe I couldn't see it or I don't know, but I've never had any issues with that. And uh, I'm just going to put these two cans right inside my crock pot, and I'm going to fill this up with water so these cans are covered over with water. you just want to make sure your water is just over the top of the cans so they're completely submerged. You don't want them sticking out of the water. And we're going to turn this up. Move it back a little bit so you can see. We're going to turn this up on low and we are going to put a cover on and then in eight hours we're going to have delicious yummy caramel sauce. So I will bring you back when they're done, about eight hours. All right, so this has been going for just over eight hours, about eight hours and three minutes. And we are gonna pull these out. They are super hot. So I'm gonna use jar tongs. And we're gonna let these cool down a little so we can handle it. Because these are super duper hot. And um, we're just going to turn our crock pot off and we're going to let these cool for a few minutes and then we will open them up and give them a try. Okay, so we've got our cans all cooled down. They're still kind of warm, but they're cooled down for the most part. And we're just going to open this up. And we have delicious creamy caramel inside. Mmm, look at that goodness. And you can see in there, it is just a nice, thick caramel in there. Just perfect. This is so good with apples or other fresh fruit or drizzled on ice cream. Anything you like caramel on, perfect for baking, anything like that. I transfer this into a glass mason jar and this will last for, uh, we've had it for at least a week I think before and um, but or you could you could probably process them in mason jars too but we just do a couple jars at a time and they are just so good and as long as you leave this can closed up it's going to stay good in here for quite a while but once you open the can I just transfer to a glass mason jar and it is ready to go and this is just a nice yummy caramel. The consistency is so nice. Alright, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Subscribe. We'll see you in the next video. Bye!